Equator Aircraft Excursion Since the beginning of aviation, many pilots have dreamed of utilizing water while maintaining long range, high speeds, and low fuel consumption. This vision inspired the creation of the world's first electric SE plane. Manufactured in Norway, this innovative vehicle is available in two- and four-person versions. The two-seater has undergone successful testing, boasting a payload of 485 pounds and a top speed of 149 miles per hour. It requires 1,312 feet to take off from water and 1,148 feet on a runway. The SE plane is powered by a 130 horsepower Enduro M97 engine and a 15 kilowatt Sony battery. Additionally, the project is developing internal combustion engine options to extend the range from 4 to 621 miles, further enhancing its versatility and appeal. Gama 003 in German and Scandinavian mythology, Gama is the name of a massive dog that guards the gates of the underworld. Inspired by this legend, the American team Barge Motive named their unique trike Gama 003. This extraordinary vehicle took approximately 18 months to construct. The creators describe riding the trike as an experience akin to surfing on a fighter jet. Powered by a 2009 Harley-Davidson 73.2 cubic inch engine, the Gama 003 offers raw power and exclusivity. While specific performance details remain undisclosed, it is known to be the only trike of its kind, with a price tag of around $200,000. Its combination of cutting-edge design and mythological inspiration makes it a standout in the world of custom vehicles. UDX Airwolf the UDX Airwolf is a cutting-edge two-seat hoverbike designed for vertical takeoff and landing, offering a thrilling glimpse into the future of personal aviation. With a top speed of 230 km per hour and the ability to accelerate from 0 to 100 km per hour in just 3 seconds, the Airwolf is engineered for both performance and excitement. It boasts a flight time of up to 25 minutes and a range of 66 km with a payload capacity of 150 kilograms. The price for this aerial marvel is set at $318,000, and operating it will require a pilot's license. Anticipated to launch in three years, the creators are actively seeking investors and have opened registrations for enthusiasts eager to experience this futuristic vehicle. More than just a thrill-seeker's dream, the Airwolf is positioned to revolutionize practical applications including cargo delivery and other specialized uses. Sismo, the 2022 auto show in the US, had a significant highlight, a flying motorcycle created by a Japanese team. This futuristic vehicle is already in production and available in Japan, with sales set to begin next year in the US. While the starting price is currently high at about $777,000, the expectation is that by 2025, it will drop to $50,000. The flying motorcycle is equipped with a hybrid Kawasaki engine, allowing it to reach speeds of up to 62 miles per hour. It has a range of up to 25 miles and can carry a payload of about 220 pounds. The manufacturers are confident that they are turning science fiction into reality. One fortunate individual who had the chance to ride the hoverbike described the experience as making him feel like a kid again, expressing sheer excitement. Twike The Twike is an innovative vehicle that blends the benefits of a bicycle and an electric car. First introduced at the 1986 Expo in Vancouver by a group of Swiss students, its popularity led to mass production and the Twike 3 model remains in production today. The next generation, the Twike 5, is set to begin production next year. This sleek, futuristic vehicle is powered by a 61-horsepower electric motor and a battery that can be charged externally or by pedaling. It boasts a range of up to 311 miles and a top speed of 118 miles per hour. Unlike traditional vehicles, the Twike uses two levers instead of a steering wheel, which the manufacturers claim is more intuitive. Pricing ranges from $38,000 to $48,000.
making it an attractive option for those seeking sustainable and efficient transportation. The Twike combines eco-friendliness, cutting-edge design, and a unique driving experience, standing out in the world of modern electric vehicles. Nimbus One The Nimbus One is a compact, eco-friendly trike designed to provide an efficient and weather-protected commuting option. Developed by the American team Nimbus, it targets individuals transitioning from cars to bicycles or scooters while maintaining comfort and safety. The trike features a closed cabin design, blending maneuverability and eco-friendliness. A single charge provides a range of 93 miles, with a top speed of 50 miles per hour for the regular version and 75 miles per hour for the S version. Priced at around $110,000, the Nimbus One is significantly more affordable than similar vehicles like the Swiss Twike. It offers modern conveniences such as an airbag, heating, Bluetooth connectivity, and optional features like air conditioning, parking assist, lane keeping assist, and an updatable intelligence system. This innovative vehicle combines style, performance, and sustainability, making it a practical solution for urban mobility. Biohybrid. The tiny pedal electric vehicle comes from the experts at the German company Schaeffler. Biohybrid is a small, eco-friendly and safe vehicle that saves a lot of space. In fact, it takes up three times less parking space than a regular car. Schaeffler Biohybrid offers two versions, one for passengers and one for cargo. The passenger model fits two people, while the cargo model has a flexible design to meet different needs like having an open or covered cargo area. It can also transform into a mobile coffee shop or a refrigeration vehicle. Both versions look similar, with a windscreen roof and open sides. The maximum speed is 25 km per hour, and it runs on one or two batteries, giving a range of 50 or 100 km. If the battery runs out, you can still pedal to continue your journey. Equipped with GPS, 4G, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth technology, the biohybrid is set for mass production this year. The best part, you won't need a driver's license or special permits to ride it. You can use it like a regular bike. The biohybrid is available in two versions. One, passenger version seats two people comfortably. Second cargo version features a modular design with options for open or covered cargo areas, making it suitable for uses like mobile coffee shops or refrigerated delivery. Both versions share a similar design, with a windscreen, roof, and open sides. The vehicle is powered by one or two batteries, offering a range of 50 to 100 kilometers, and has a maximum speed of 25 kilometers per hour. If the battery runs out, users can continue their journey by pedaling manually. Equipped with GPS, 4G, Wi-Fi, and Bluetooth, the biohybrid is a modern solution for urban transportation. Mass production is planned, and the best part is that no driver's license or special permits are required to use it. It's a revolutionary alternative for eco-conscious commuters and businesses alike. AirDrive. The AirDrive is an innovative amphibious vehicle designed to operate across various terrains, including land, water, and even mountainous regions. Its inflatable nature makes it highly versatile and easy to transport. The vehicle is equipped with electric motors in each wheel, allowing it to navigate different environments with ease. What makes the air drive particularly fascinating is its remote control capabilities, making it suitable not only for recreational use, but also for rescue operations and other practical applications. Presented at the Matras Show, the world's largest marine equipment exhibition, this vehicle's inventors are open to ideas and suggestions showcasing their commitment to innovation and collaboration. The air drive represents a major leap forward in the development of amphibious transportation. Cycle QMX For an exhilarating experience, check out the incredible Cycle QMX, crafted by Florida specialists. Combining the best features of a bicycle and an electric scooter, it's essentially a four-wheeler BMX bike with an additional electric drive. Featuring front and rear suspension and large 20-inch tires, 
It delivers impressive cross-country ability and riding comfort. The Cycle QMX can navigate various terrains like sand, snow and grass and handle small obstacles with ease. The manufacturer offers three models. Urban Eano with a 500-watt brushless motor, Urban Sport with a more powerful 750-watt engine and efficient brakes, and the outstanding Urban Assault with a 1,000-watt engine, reaching a maximum speed of just over 38 km per hour. Whether riding using only the motor's energy or combining it with pedaling for faster speeds, the Cycle QMX promises a thrilling and efficient adventure. Its rugged design and electric assist provide a fun, versatile and practical solution for off-road cycling. Bardin. While the flying cabs of today aren't quite as advanced as those in the fifth element, the concept is gaining traction. A US company aims to launch the first air taxi hub by 2025, and unmanned passenger drones are already undergoing testing in South Korea. Russia is also in the game, showcasing a prototype of a flying cab in development since 2015. The final version is anticipated to accommodate up to four passengers and reach speeds of about 181 miles per hour. Equipped with smart features, the cab aims for self-sufficiency, capable of searching for passengers, planning routes, and undergoing recharging and maintenance without human intervention. The Bardin is a futuristic concept in air transportation, designed to be part of the growing field of flying cabs. While current flying cabs are still in early stages of development, the Bardin represents a significant step toward realizing this vision. A US company is working toward launching the first air taxi hub by 2025, while unmanned passenger drones are already undergoing testing in countries like South Korea. In Russia, a prototype of a flying cab has been under development since 2015, with the final version expected to accommodate up to four passengers. This flying vehicle is anticipated to reach speeds of around 181 miles per hour and will feature smart technologies allowing it to plan routes, find passengers, and perform self-maintenance and recharging without human intervention. The Bardin, along with other flying vehicle innovations, aims to revolutionize urban transportation by offering a faster, more efficient way to travel through congested cities.